what is poppin', man? It is your boy Vincent, aka the CL Motivation, back again with another video, man. How's everyone doing? Hope everyone's doing well. Mm, excuse me. Welcome to Stat Squad, the channel only involves positivity, motivation, and inspiration. If you guys are new, make sure you comment, like, share, subscribe, and also, mm, excuse me, hit the notification bell so you don't miss any more videos from us, guys, when we post. And if you're OG member of Stat Squad, salute to you. Thank you for tuning in as always. But for today's video, we're going to talk about rise above the storm and you will find your own sunshine or create your own sunshine or whatever the two. But we're going to get into that. <clears throat> Excuse me. If y'all guys have any other video ideas, please let us know in the comment section down below. So we can um, get more videos out to y'all. But let's go and get started, man. So rise above, rise above the storm. That just means, you know what I'm saying, um, overcoming any challenges or any odds that come towards you guys. Because y'all guys know life is going to throw you some hard uh, curveballs. And you got to be able to, you know what I'm saying, to um, deal with them head on, you know what I'm saying, face the problems head on. And, you know what I'm saying, just just get through everything overall, man. You know, come out on top and, you know, face those problems because, you know, in life, you're going to deal with some sort of um, bad event, or you know what I'm saying, or ugly event. And you, you can't do nothing but deal with it, you know what I'm saying. So, um, the best thing to do is just to go through it, man. Get it over with, knock it out of the box, and then everything's going to be good, you know what I'm saying. And that's honestly all you really can do at this point, man. But um, don't let these problems, you know what I'm saying, get in your head too much and, you know, stop you from what you actually want to do, you know what I mean? Because everyone wants to be successful. You want to work hard for your keep and, you know what I'm saying, for the American dream and everything. And, you know, um, that's honestly it, though. You really just want to work hard for the stuff that you want, you know what I'm saying? Because... Um, nothing ain't free in the world. You're going to have to work for it some way or another, you know what I'm saying? And, um, that's just how everything works out. But, um, now creating your own sunshine, that's basically just saying, you know, um, pave your own way or, you know, um, if you want to relate to a career, you know what I'm saying, then find a career. Like, you know, um, like the best thing you want to do is, um, what you call it, uh, what you want to do is you want to beat all the odds, all the challenges that come your way, and then, you know, pave your own way to success and your own way to greatness and make sure you achieve the dreams and careers that you want. And, you know, that's honestly all that is, guys, because you got to know, um, <clears throat> excuse me, man, I'm sorry. But, um... So what you want to, so what you want to do is, you know, um, you just want to be able to take them problems head on, face them, and be successful in there. Because you know everything ain't gonna be smooth. It's like you know what I'm saying, like cotton candy and rainbows and stuff like that. That was a terrible example, but whatever. Um, and you know, you just want to be able to face everything. You want to be able to face it, your problems head on and stuff like that. Let's hit the thumbnail real quick. But yeah, so you know, you just want to um, give off good vibes and you want to be able to overcome all your challenges, guys. You know what I'm saying? Use those tough times and challenges as a way to develop and get better and improve your skills. You know what I'm saying? And you know, that's honestly it because that's kind of what bad moments are there for. Bad moments are meant for you, are meant to, um, to build you up into a better person so that way... When, you know, bad moments like that come again, you'll be able to face them head on again. And, you know what I'm saying, there won't be no problem then. So, you know, look at these bad moments as, like, motivation and use them to fuel yourself to keep going harder for what you want in life. Don't let the bad moments take over your life and turn you into a bad person or, you know what I'm saying, hurt your feelings and bring you down. Use them as, like, a positive, you know what I'm saying. Turn that negative into a positive is what they said, man. That was corny. But, um... It's true though, guys, for real, because challenges, guys, you're not going to be able to avoid challenges at all at any time in your life. Challenges will come, 
But those challenges are meant to better your skill, better you as a person, and hone your skills, man. So, um, the only thing you can do is go against them, you know what I'm saying? If you can't beat them, join them. That's what you got to do with challenges, man, because challenges are going to come regardless whether you like it or not. And they can come at any time in your life, and you have to figure out how to deal with them and deal with them the right way, you know what I'm saying? Don't try to walk away from the challenge. Don't try to ignore the challenge. You're going to have to face it head on, guys, if you want to be successful in life because challenges are going to be there. Challenges are always going to be there, guys, whether you like it or not. Challenges are going to be there, so the best thing you can do is just deal with it. But, yeah, guys, like, use your bad moments, determine the good moments, and also use those moments to focus on what you really want to do. You know what I'm saying? Because bad moments can really fuel you and motivate you to go out there and do great things in life. Seriously, man. Like, that's what I, that's what I do with bad moments. Like, you know what I'm saying? You got to turn it into something good and use it to build yourself up to keep going harder for what you want, guys. You know what I'm saying? Because bad moments can frustrate people, can hurt people's feelings, and stop them from what they actually want to do in life. But you can't let bad moments do that to you. You still have to be successful and come out on top in whatever you want to do. You can't let no challenges stop you. That's what uh, that's what being motivated is really about, guys. If you're really motivated, when challenges come your way, you'll be like, come on, challenge. I I'm ready to take you on. You know what I'm saying? You don't want to be like, oh, man, I ain't ready to deal with this challenge yet. Man, I'm going to screw that, man. I'm gone. You can't do that with a challenge. You can't walk away. You can't ignore it. You have to deal with it head on, whether you like it or not. There's nothing you can do when a challenge come your way. You have to face it. That's the only way you're going to get... That's, all, that's the only way you're going to prove yourself is by dealing with it head on. But trying to avoid it, you, you're not going to avoid a challenge at all, guys. Like, you might not like that, but it's true. You can't avoid no challenges ever in your life. You're going to have to deal with them head on, man, for real. Like, there ain't, there ain't, there ain't no way you're going to be able to deal with a challenge without, you know what I'm saying, like... Let's get that there real quick. But yeah, guys. But like for real, use challenges to better yourself, to better your skills, and to better your personality. And you know what I'm saying? Make better changes for your life. Positive changes. Don't let challenges and bad moments knock you down from what you truly want to do. Because that's also another thing, too. Bad moments can literally stop you and change you into a person that you don't want to be. Like, you could go from being a happy person, and then if a challenge gets to you too much, you might be like, oh, man, forget this. I don't want to do this no more. But you can't do that, guys. Like, seriously, bad challenge. I mean, challenges can turn you into a monster, guys, for real. So, you, you got to be really you gotta be really careful when challenges come, for real. Because you can't. You can't you can't let no challenge take you over. If you let a challenge take you over, then you know what I'm saying I guess you're not ready to fix that challenge yet. But don't let no challenges stop you. Oh shoot, hold on. But nah, don't let no challenges stop you from what you want to really do. But yep, yeah, that's going on with this video here, guys. I got one more video to post for tonight. Once I post this last video for tonight, I'll be chilling. I don't plan on making 12 videos. In one day like this before because this crap is not good for time management bro I literally had all day well I mean the only reason that really slowed me down was because my phone was low you know what I'm saying I didn't want to use it until it died because then the video probably wouldn't save so that's why I had to wait for my phone to charge and stuff up but if my percentage was good all these videos wouldn't have been done earlier today but um thank y'all for watching me to the end of the video man thank you we appreciate love and support over here don't forget to comment, like, share, subscribe, and also hit that bell so you don't miss any more videos from us, guys, when we post. Stay motivated, stay dedicated with purpose, and don't let no one tell you you can't do nothing on this earth because you can. It's all about your mindset, the motivation, and time and effort you put into what you want to do. But y'all guys got this, and y'all know this already. But the seal motivation is logging off. Stat Squad is out of here. I'll see y'all in the next video, man. Love y'all. Um, Stat Squad on top, baby.